Hey guys, today we're gonna take a look at a dirty bag. I'm just joking. Well, as you know, Nikon makes some great cameras, actually, and they've been doing that for years, and uh, especially the Nikon P900 and P1000, which I really adore those two cameras. I know they have way more than that. Did you know that they actually make uh, binoculars too, which makes sense. It's a camera company. They know about lenses, so... Here it is. I've had these for years, years and years. I just never really shown them to a lot of people. And when I spoke to people, sometimes they would tell me, Nikon, no, they don't make binoculars. Well, surprise, surprise. They actually make some really good quality. Small, I must say, small, but great quality binoculars. These ones here. Nikon 8x25, 8.2, whatever you call that, water resistant. Yes, they were from a NASCAR. So, and here on the back is their whatever serial number you want to call. What's in them? Here on the right side, you can actually adjust this to your eye. It's something tr uh, interesting that I learned, and I didn't know that before either, that our left eye and right eye are not the same. Apparently, I to some people, yes, but not to all of us. And uh, I discovered that when I started using these for just small stuff, when I'd go to parks and whatnot or to races. And somehow I, I, I didn't know that I had to change this little setting here. As you see, plus and minus, this goes back and forth. Let me just spin it like that. And I thought, okay, maybe the binoculars are not okay. Because I, I, I couldn't, I could see really clear from the left, but not from the right. And yes, I heard actual, an actual doctor say that Nikon put this here because they knew about that part of the human eye. And isn't that beautiful? And besides that, I tried to take a glimpse of a picture with my phone but it's so hard to take a, a look through the lens with a phone i there are other professionals that know how to do that i don't so you're seeing now probably on screen how brutal of a job i did trying to put this on a camera and as you see that doesn't always go well and it's really not easy to do so. And here are the lenses. Here are the lenses on the back. Really clear, even though I have to clean them, but they're clear looking. And uh, yeah, this is something that I wanted to share with you guys for a while now. And I had no idea that so many people didn't even know that Nikon actually makes... Uh, very nice binoculars the build quality is really good it's some kind of aluminum i would say based on the temperature feel and metal it has some plastic parts as well of course There's nothing without plastic these days and they have some weight the meaning that the lenses inside are actually quite good and when you look through them i wish i knew better how to how to film through these with my camera how clear crystal clear the view comes through them it's it's really something magnificent magnificent and uh with that said that's all i just wanted to share with you really not not really a in-depth video of how to use binoculars because i guess and i hope that's not necessary because most of you and if not all of you know how to use binoculars and have used them before and uh with that said just enjoy a small uh b-roll at the end of this video and we'll see you on the next time bye